these stupid fucking capitalists and their goddamn stupid argument saying that evolution and natural selection and Darwin supports the capitalist ideal. Um, no, actually it doesn't when it comes to humans. Humans evolved in social groups. We worked together in tribes. That's what tribalism is. That is how we worked. Humans survive because we work together. You send one human all alone out to the woods, he's gonna fucking die. He is not the top of the fucking food chain. You forget that we are not the top of the food chain. Gorillas can't even, like, fight off bears and shit, or lions. Gorillas get killed by lions all the time in the wild. We can't, if gorillas can't fight off a goddamn lion, we can't. We survive by making tools and sticking together. So, your whole idea that, um, Darwinian natural selection and evolution supports your goddamn ideal, you are fucking wrong. Or right, I'm gonna read to you, um, this quote from one of the um, comments up to my video about communism labor I made a while ago. It's by a man named Nick Jones Radio. Weird name, whatever. Why would doctors be thrown into fields? Who discussed this with you as a legitimate point? They would be allowed to stay in their, f in their field, merely lacking incentive to do any better than any other doctor. Okay? You'd be lacking Darwinism. The idea is that the strong survive, and thus we evolve and become better. That's why communism doesn't work. What an idiot. This is the major argument made by capitalist pigs, quote-unquote, and is perfectly in line with the common logic. Clinics have been set up to help children to with inadequate parents. Okay? I don't see where your argument... You're wrong about deranging natural selection. And I know that there have been clinics up to send to help children. I don't remember saying anything about that. And, um, no, no, that has nothing to do with capitalism. If you see, um, if you see, uh, Charles Dawkins' video, Nice Guys Finish First, you will see that capitalism, right wing, does not work with Darwinian evolution. It's basically just playing, um, tit for tat. If you help someone else and they help you, you both reap the rewards, and you reap a bigger award. If you just steal from someone else, you get a bigger award, but they don't. And you eventually just start sucking up all the resources. And these people don't get anything, and they die. That isn't natural selection. Hell, you see, most capitalists are big, fat, ugly, not strong at all. They don't... They would not last in the wild. They, do not, they did not evolve. We're actually de-evolving. We're becoming fucking stupider thanks to capitalism. It taking over our lives, it running our lives, running the universities, running the military, running the fucking world. We're de-evolving. Our IQ is dropping. In communism, the second communism came into power, the life expectancy in China and Russia, they went from like 30 years old to fucking 60 and 70 years old. Communism helps people live, communism helps people survive, and communism is what evolution will go with. Humans evolve socially and physically through our social means. We do not fucking evolve by just killing each other and competing with each other constantly over fucking everything. No, we work together and we share. That is how we got to where we are today, because people stick stuck together. If a human went out in the wild, they would die. So your argument saying that evolution supports capitalism is wrong. I'm going to put a link over into the sidebar to uh, Charles Dawkins' uh, Nice Guys Finish First. Now I hope this Nick Jones radio guy watches it and see how he's wrong. Um, thank you. Goodbye.